Bear with us. It's Just, okay. If he, we say he, AC, we is, mean Armando. He is my Japanese brethren. I will not question him. So we do get the snake after all. And we also get the double Luigi too. Yep. So uh, just just as we expected, pretty much. No, and this team just goes ahead and just explodes on the damage over and over. Especially the fact that they both understand how Luigi works. They know exactly what moves to go and follow up when they see a forward air, a back air, really anything going out. Uh oh, Charlie gonna lose that sock. Apparently air dodging, and there we go. The grab leading to the back air. There we go, Luigi's taking the first two stocks and a great lead forward tilt. Going off that shield, here comes the Nikita. Oh, Nikita. Does a great move getting that stock. Try to go for another one, not gonna land though. Yeah, Nikita is just so good, man. It's really, really quick. Oh no, Charlie! He ended up trying to shield, and since he was holding the shield button, he got the air dodge when he landed off stage. It seemed like that's uh, a little bit what happened with the first stock as well. The hold buffer is still something he's trying to get used to. Yeah, but that is two quick stocks that, that he has lost. Blue team have a commanding lead at the moment. And as I say that, you know, <laughs> not on Panelian actually almost losing the stock. Yeah, good green missile to go ahead and get it right back, but he does eat that up smash immediately. And even with those two stocks that are gone, you know, red team is able to bring it back. All right. That doesn't have a double jump yet, and that's what I was saying. Luigi having such a nerf recovery, very difficult for him to get back to stages. And while that down air actually taking Charlie's stock. Uh, Charlie lo losing uh, all three of his stocks in really unorthodox fashion. Even with that in play, it's down to the wire. I mean, honestly, that's just the life of a Spacey sometimes. Uh, yeah. And, 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 you know, him losing those stocks means be him being such a glass cannon type character means that he's going to put on the damage and also take those stocks. Yeah, but Armando doing a great job holding onto his own stocks. And as I say that, Dash is not going to get shielded and losing it immediately from that down smash. Double parry from Con Con. And he parried the down smash from Elegant, too. So he's not trying to take no ill advice for Sen at the moment. All right. Fireball forcing him to get up. Ooh, the top smash. They're not going to go ahead and connect. The jab locks down tilt. Okay. Charlie getting any percent that he can at the moment. With grab. Uh, Charlie playing hyper focused right now, trying to make up for the fact that he lost his three stocks so early. I'm surprised he didn't chase down to try to get an up smash on Elegant. Yeah, but nonetheless, didn't want to really commit to an option to put himself in a dangerous position. Great coverage from Konkan, saving his teammate. Using a dash attack. Yeah, great no. back air coming out from Konkan, getting the edge guard. Punishing that unsafe recovery coming up, that really high up B from Charlie. Yeah, I mean, when Fox is just in your face charging up the Firefox, that is free real estate yeah. for you to just go in there and take it away, hit him out of it. I could also see why he may want to do it that early in that situation, but because there are two in a 2v1 situation, it's a little bit different. Sometimes it works more of a, of a mix up. He may try and get a stray hit or two in there. Uh, but still, yeah, Con Con not going to slip up at all. All right, here we go, game two to, to stadium. Running it straight back to stadium. Yeah, I mean, really, Charlie didn't even get to play with his stocks. No, he didn't get to play, <laughs> like, at all. He, like, he, he took, he, he didn't play with his stocks at all. He actually played with Armando's stock. Yep. That's what happened. <laughs> yeah, so looking for him to clean it up here in game two. And already it's looking like, he, you know, he didn't lose his stock to himself. This time around, he just got comboed. Oh, yeah. Either way, not a, not oh, a great There goes look. another tornado catching him there at the top, not allowing our model to just recover for free with that Cypher. And this double Luigi team, such a force, as I already said. Just the damage output for them is so ridiculous, and the kill power as well coming out. <laughs> Charlie dancing around uh, Snake C4 here, potentially trying to get one of them to. Let it to jump over there, and so our yeah, he definitely got it, both yeah. of them. One with the C4, one with that up tilt. And I like this Kong Kong just waiting for his teammate, take full advantage of that angel platform. Armando just trying to land right back down. Do you see the blue team, even though the snake is on the other side, trying to set up shop with the projectiles? These Luigi's don't care. They're like, all right, cool. You're going to go over there trying to set up. This is great. I'm going to go after this Fox, which I'm going to combo, yeah. which I'm going to gimp. Make, make this thing hurt. Yeah, it, it really, really hurts for, for Charlie, in fact. I mean, after all, 
This is notoriously like a matchup that's in, in the past been in favor because of the down beacon, but also the combo game is still there. Fox is still a fast faller. There goes the key. Great, crazy combo. Yeah, able to get away. Plunge and grab. Not gonna go ahead and get Charlie there. Though. Combo just threatening. Gets that back throw. Okay, I'm surprised he didn't go for a fourth throw or possibly a down throw to set up more elegant. But okay, more power to him. Still have the stock lead. Sorry, made a leap on this. Gets his teammate a little bit more. But regardless, that stock is gone. And that shield looking like a Reese's Pieces. Armando taking so much percent. The grenade coming in clutch. Oh my gosh. Charlie playing with fire. That shield getting so abused right now. Armando, uh, not, not a light character by any means, but he is sitting at dangerously high percents. He's going to want to play as safe as possible. Yeah, you already see all the smash attacks coming out from the Luigi. He's trying to take it away, and they do. And there you have the up B out from Concon, trying to get the early stop. Yeah, I mean, all trades are going in the favor of the blue team at the moment. It's exactly what the Luigi's want. This is looking yeah, Charlie's like in between Charlie both of them. Right Such now. a bad spot. Forward throw. Oh my goodness, using the grab armor. Yes. Gets him right back yeah. off stage. Really easily disengages, going to Concon. <laughs> yeah, back air. That is not going to be it. He's going to try to recover with the Fire Fox. They end up hitting each other. Uh, yeah. Charlie thought that he got hit, so he tried to tech. Unfortunately, that was not the case. Concon and Elegant moving on. Getting that W, yeah, and two, it looks like victory. they are going to be seeing Mirio and Phoenix in losers. Oh no, Easy in Houston. Sorry, I got ahead of myself. Easy in Houston first. Easy, and Easy Houston. in Houston. That's why they're sitting there at the setup still. Very great. But yeah, it, that, it was a bit of unfortunate for uh, Charlie and who is he just playing with? Armando. Armando. That's why I'm, I'm all confused. It's like AC Armando. <laughs> AC Armando.